Krishna. My name is Tirthavid Devnath and my topic is Sashti Puja. One day, Sachi Mata, along with her neighboring ladies, went to perform Sashti Puja under a banyan tree. Vishwambara, who was playing nearby, went, ran to see what his mother was carrying. Nima, extending his arms to the sides, blocked Sachi's way and demanded, Let me see what you are carrying, mother. And then Sachimata said that we are ca carefully taking the food offerings to worship, worship Goddess Sashti. And you just stay here and play. When I return, I will give you some bananas and some desh. And I will ask also ask for a boon that you will be free from all the inauspiciousness and all the sufferings. Hearing this, Gaurahari Gorari said, Oh mother, you will not understand, but I am experiencing great suffering right this minute. My belly is burning with hunger. Then, as quick as lightning, Gorari snatched the sweets Sachimata was saving for worshipping Goddess Sashti and popped them in his mouth. And Sachimata, somewhat upset, said, that, alas, what you have done, you naughty boy, why are you so mischievous? Do you know what you have done? You have disrespected the demigods. Surprisingly, Gaurahari became very angry and told, Oh mother, you don't know anything. I know everything and I am in all the three worlds. Just like pouring water on the tree and live it, energizes the tree branches, and just like providing food to the stomach and livens the senses and the limbs. Just like that, uh, worshipping only the Supreme Personality of Godhead satisfies all the demigods who are the parts of the Supreme Personality. And then she went to pe perform Shasti Puja. After worshipping Shasti Puja, she asked for the boon that she... Uh, she her, her son Nimai should be uh, free from all the inauspiciousness and sufferings. And then she held her son's hand, Nimai's hand, and went home and told her husband that she thought that her son was the god of all gods. Goranga!